The numbers just got exposed. In today's video, I have a major update for AMC stock regarding shocking numbers that were just exposed. And guys, if you own AMC stock, you need to watch this video. Before I begin, if you like AMC stock, be sure to smash that like button. It only takes a few seconds and I really would appreciate it. Also, be sure to hit that subscribe button if you're new so you don't miss out on future videos. Keep in mind, this is not financial advice. This video is only for entertainment purposes. Be sure to do your own research and verify the information yourself as I am not a financial advisor. So guys, let's get right into it. So in this video, I want to go over these shocking numbers that were just exposed and why I think this could spell trouble for short sellers. Make sure you guys pay close attention to what I'm about to share with you because this is absolutely nuts. Also, guys, keep in mind that the stock market is closed today in the U.S. for Good Friday. So according to sources, AMC is currently number two in terms of the highest cost to borrow in the worldwide markets. This is a huge deal because a stock stock borrow fee is the fee charged by a broker to lend shares to short sellers to bet against the stock. The higher the fee, the harder it becomes to borrow the stock. With AMC having such a massive cost to borrow percentage, this means that these short sellers are likely paying millions and millions of dollars just to continue to borrow these shorted shares. If they don't cover soon, in my opinion, they could continue to lose a lot of money in the fees that they are paying to borrow the shares. This is why I strongly believe AMC is not a dead play. I predict until the shorts cover or until majority of the retail investors sell, AMC still has a chance to potentially take off. Now guys, do me a favor, drop a comment and let me know if you think the shorts will cover soon. With that said, if you enjoyed this quick update, be sure to smash that like button. I really would appreciate it. Also, be sure to hit that subscribe button if you're new so you don't miss out on future videos. Keep in mind, this is not financial advice. This video is only for entertainment purposes. You should never make any decisions to buy, hold, or sell stocks based on this video.